the few few from the top of the staff quarters being constructed just to give you a bit of permanent building site and it is temple building site and today is 21st of June 2022 the longest day of the year the summer solstice and this is what you see after the flood water has receded by some six inches the water has receded by some six inches during the night so this is a falling trend for the river actually the river had started to flow over this area after it changed course because of the amount of water in it that is the river at a distance and it takes a turn there somewhere and so it made a straight head a straight dash towards this portion of the river and the building the water did not climb the bling building get into the building but it was all over the campus so this is the highest flood level as you see hfl and this is the river and this is what do you see this is the river salqua mora salqua it is much alive now but the water has decreased by some six inches and this is what we see and this is the public road uh, which was also inundated and this has happened for the first time you see this court uh, premise one wall towards the uh, south collapsed there and did not collapse of course because of its strength and it was a testing time for the wall of the school and it uh, in fact saved it from further damage in so this is what we see from here the empty offices there have been taken over by people who have been who have been whose houses have been inundated and they have taken shelter there so this is the mora salqua mora means dead but it is very much alive and this is what we see after the water has receded by some six inches and let us hope that there is no further rain and the water decreases more and more and that it will definitely so that normalcy returns to Barpeta as a whole and to this school in particular today the international day of yoga 21st of June and I am the principal of this school making this video from atop the quarters staff quarters which are being constructed here. Yeah.